side with more. Rob. Well, this is the neighborhood where the man who was killed lived with his parents. No answer at the front door this afternoon, but neighbors and a lot of people who live in this community still have many questions about exactly what happened. Corona police are still investigating the deadly shooting at this Costco Friday night. They're not releasing the name of the off-duty cop who fired his weapon, but Eyewitness News has learned these are the three people who were shot. A mother and father from Riverside and their 32-year-old son, Kenneth French. He's the one who was killed. I don't know if he has autism, but he's a not talkative. He doesn't even talk. Ramon Vase lives next door to the French family. He says Kenneth French was disabled. Did Kenneth ever show any sign of violence? No, not him. Not him. Yeah, he's uh, he's a uh, sweet. I said, I said, he doesn't even say. He's always like when he pick up the man, his head is down. You know, he walk, he pick up. He doesn't say even hi or anything. Corona police say the off-duty cop was at the store shopping with his family. They say he was holding his young child in his arms when Kenneth French assaulted him. The officer then pulled out his gun and fired, hitting both French and his two family members. If you carry a gun, doesn't, especially in California, you cannot withdraw your gun. You are an off-duty officer, mm -hmm. for God's sake. What happens if you don't have the gun? Nobody will be dead, honestly. No updates from Corona Police this afternoon, but in an earlier press release, they do refer to this off-duty cop as a victim. Again, the LAPD is launching their own investigation into what their officer did. Only one weapon, the officer's, was found at the scene. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.